all right the trailer is everywhere and again very slow month for movie trailers apparently so we'll check it out this is jean du berry fucking a <laughs> Wait, when was the French Revolution? Whatever. King Louis the Fifteenth? Was he worse than Louis the Fourteenth? Was he worse than Louis the Thirteenth? He was the worst since Louis the First. Le roi rencontre Jeanne. Jeanne du Barry. Ne regardez pas le roi dans les yeux. Non, ne montre pas ses sentiments à la cour. Fuck, I didn't realize there's subtitles. I wasn't paying attention. Hold on. <laughs> ne regardez pas le roi dans les yeux. Non, ne montre pas ses sentiments à la cour. Okay, it's just, you know, your typical French bullshit. Oh, she did the thing. She looked him in the eyes. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> Who does she think she is? Sorry, you guys can read, right? Most of you. Vertical. Yeah, I bet he went vertical. <laughs> Sorry. Sa Majesté le Roi aimerait revoir Madame. Je suis très honorée, Majesté. Vin de champagne. C'est vous? She looking for the Temple of Doom or something? What? Je vous êtes auprès d'elle. Quand le soleil se lève <laughs> et quand le soleil se couche. Voilà tout. J'aimerais que vous restiez ici à Versailles. <gasps> the scandal. Again, French aristocracy. Is there was there never not a scandal? Vous n'êtes pas sans savoir qu'une infâme rumeur court à Versailles. <laughs> Shock the kingdom. <laughs> I got news for those people. It's not going to end well for them anyway. Utilisez toute votre influence pour que cette misérable femme soit chassée de la cour. Majesté, c'est l'union entre la France et l'Autriche qui est en danger. Vous savez ce qu'il reste à faire. Not the union between France and Austria. Je ne peux pas m'empêcher d'avoir peur pour toi. Vous êtes en train de découvrir le côté sombre du roi. Not the king's dark side. I'm sorry, I just. I can't get into this. C'est grotesque. Non. C'est Versailles. <laughs> no, this is Sparta. Um, so, okay. Call me cynical, right? But did Napoleon do so well in theaters that they're like, man, what other French thing can we do? I, you know, you got American actor, right, playing some French person, <laughs> historical French figure. You know, it's, yeah, there, there you go. That's Napoleon all over again. Maybe I shouldn't have covered this one because, <laughs> again, I, I just, I, could not care less about it. Uh, I just, you know, Johnny Depp was on it. His newest trailer. So, fuck it, you know? But, uh, yeah, that. Let's see what other people have to say about it. Let's see what the, the common folk <laughs> have to say regarding this. I'm glad to see him back on screen. At last, Johnny Deep is back on screen. Oh, yeah, I guess maybe that's sort of a big deal. I forgot that he was, he's been kind of shunned by people who don't follow court proceedings that took up like 
everybody's headspace on the internet. They call this a Johnny Depp movie, but he got like 100 words in it. I, I had to read that one because just so many things just kind of came at me at once about it. Uh, for one, nobody said it was a Johnny Depp movie. He is in the thumbnail, but I think that's because the actual namesake of the movie, I don't recognize that woman from anywhere. So you got Johnny Depp, so put him in the, the thumbnail, right? Um, he got like 100 words in it. Well, you, you, did you watch the movie <laughs> or did we just see a trailer? Because, yeah, it's, it's just the trailer. It doesn't say anything about how many lines he has or how important his character is it seems like his character is very important given that he is the one who falls in love with again the namesake of the movie problem number three is you're fucking wolverine you should know all about the french because he's canadian and that's their whole shtick right it's given me well if america turned back on you go to europe they appreciate you better oh shit is that why this is a foreign film or at least a film all in a, another language. It could just be 100% French, like a French production, everything. I didn't even think of that. Maybe he was blacklisted. Yeah, this person said, The Batman. Oh, you got Wolverine and Batman in the comments section. What the hell? Uh, didn't Hollywood blacklist this guy after the Amber Heard situation? And the reply says, Nope, that was just Warner Brothers and Disney jumping the gun. After the defamation trial, they had to eat crow. Disney even tried to get him to come back for another Pirates movie, but he had said that he would never again work for them. Well, good for him. But at the same time, it made sense that, oh, he's back in a film, but it's not an American film <laughs> kind of kind of idea. But uh, yeah, I mean, maybe maybe it was just Warner Brothers and Disney. I'd believe it. Uh, I mean, but I also believe it's it's all a cult over there anyway. So I believe everybody blacklisted him, regardless of you know what actually happened. So yeah, that's. Oh wait, hold on. I gotta read this other comment that just caught my eye. Sacre bleu. <laughs> nah, chef's kiss. French French. Blah, blah, blah. Uh, uh, yeah, <laughs> whatever the fuck this movie was called, thanks for watching.